To get started with fill in the blank question type, begin by selecting the plus symbol to add a new question. Then select fill in the blank. Begin by typing out the question you'd like students to identify the blank in. To add your blank space, click add blank. Then type the answer into the key below. To continue typing your sentence, select the question text bar and continue typing your sentence. You can also add multiple blank spaces for students to fill in by simply clicking add blank again, then filling in the answer key for the blank space. If the blank has multiple correct responses, make sure to include the other correct responses in the key to avoid incorrectly marking an answer as incorrect. You can toggle on allowing partial credit to automatically give your students partial credit if they get some of the answers correct. By toggling on allow partial match, if you type keywords into your answer key, student responses that include those keywords will be graded as correct. To make your answer key case sensitive, you can toggle on case sensitive as well. Now that your fill in the blank question is ready to go, let's take a look at how students will respond. Students can click on the box and type their answer. Their answer will automatically save so that you can get data insights instantly.